That is my secret. What's my secret to body odor? Uh, controlling, is that how you say it? Good to control a body odor. I wanna get this hair, is this a hairnet? Yeah, satin cap, I'm annoyed. I call it a hairnet, it's like Ghana Force, I know everyone knows, hairnets. I hairnets in a way, Ghana Force, I'm away. It's Valentino, <laughs> so like, you know what I'm saying? I don't even need to use it, I just wanna look at it, you know? Okay, Ali juicing, juicy, yep, eating, juicy, apple, her. So we have two different, oh yeah, 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 Apple me, apple me, make me apple. <laughs> Okay, I'm literally carrying the stuff in, <laughs> in a blanket. What in the whole entire world? <laughs> What up, it's your girl, Mina. In this video, I'm about to show you a huge haul that I did with Sephora. And you might be thinking, what in the world, how many things does she need from Sephora? That is not what we are here to discuss. We are here to discuss the items that I had to restock on and the new things that I have that I don't have that I wanted to get, okay? So if you love a good Sephora haul, then this video is for you. Also, make sure you follow me on Instagram and on TikTok. I'm on both of those platforms and I'm not here, so make sure you follow me there. And let's see, all links are gonna be below for all the products that I discussed, so make sure you look at that description box. If you're watching on your television, go on over to your phone, honey, and check out the description box, okay? Now let's get started. Okay, now let me just say it is golden hour. So if I'm looking very rich and golden, that's why. Let me know if you're loving the golden hour goldenness. <laughs> yes. First of all, I I didn't have time to find a basket to put these things in, and I had already took it, taken them out of the Sephora box, so <laughs> hence why I carried it here in the blanket, okay? Into the bedroom, I, I do want to clarify. One of the products that I've restocked on because it is an absolute must, there's no particular order for this. I'm gonna just grab what I can and talk about it. The first product is the First A Beauty Ingrown Hair Pads. Honey child, I got four of these. I already have some in the stash and I'm, you actually I have one pad left in the container that I'm using actually currently. Okay, and I have two in my suitcase for when I travel. These are an absolute must. If you have seen my summer shower routine, then you know that I talked about this. If you have just been following me for any amount of time, then you know that I talked about this. If you're new, let me teach you about this, okay? So these have BHA and AHA in them. AHA and BHA are products that clear out the pores, okay? They kill bacteria. Now the AHA clears out the top layer of skin. The BHA just is an ingredient, okay? It clears out the deeper layer of the skin. BHAs are great if you have acne. So it clears the acne causing bacteria, all right? It fights that and then it takes away the pimple. We're not supposed to pop our pimples. We're supposed to use a product like like this, which has BHA in it. So this is intended for ingrown hairs in your bikini area, okay? Whether you're shaving, whether you're waxing, whether you have blood pumping through your veins, you likely have experienced ingrown hairs, okay? This can be used if you're a guy, if you have a husband, brother, father, whatever. This can certainly be used on their beard, mustache, back of the neck, chin, neck, all of that, because of haircuts and stuff, right? But for us women, this can be used anywhere you might get ingrown hairs. Let's say your hormones cause you to have hair on your face, okay? We've all been there. Then, and let's say you're shaving or you're waxing or whatever and you're getting bumps, use this there. Let's say that you get bumps in your armpits, use this there, let it dry or just pat dry and then you know, you're good to go. Follow the instructions because you do wanna make sure you use this the day after you have shaved or waxed, not the same day, it's gonna burn, baby, because this is an exfoliating product. And of course, in the bikini area. I love using this in my armpits and the bikini area and let me explain why. I'm not necessarily using it for the ingrown hair benefits, although that of course is good, right? Those boils and stuff get really irritating. The reason why I'm using this product and the reason why I love this product is come a little closer, odor. Okay, if you're new here, then you just, you need to know your girl does not like odor of any kind, okay? And I'm always tackling odor every single day. This is something that you have to do on a daily basis, not just one and done, absolutely not, especially in the summertime, that you're dead wrong, okay? We have to talk about this. So take a shower and do your usual shower routine. And in my shower routine, I think I discussed what I do in the shower to fight odor, I don't recall, but the word tomorrow afterward, okay? I know I'm going the long way, this is important, pay attention. Wipe yourself with this after you have showered, in the armpit, in the groin, you do your whole bikini, okay? We're not talking about the vulva, 
We've discussed this. We're not going into the inner ca the cavities and stuff. This is for outer skin, external use, okay? But go ahead and use this because it's going to what? Kill the bacteria that causes odor. It's going to kill the odor causing bacteria in your armpit and also in the groin area. I'm telling you right now, this stuff works. I have done this routine and showered or been outside. Yo, yesterday, if you see my vlog, you'll see that at some point, I was at an outdoor event, 90 degrees in Houston. I had done my routine. I had wiped myself with this armpit. You just take the same one, armpit, groin, right? Do front, then back, back is last. You should know already. And then, I, I mean, I was sweating. Everybody was sweating and I did not smell. When I got home, I did not smell. Do you hear me? I did not smell. These are pads, obviously, so it makes the application very easy. However, I want you to know that if you have any other BHA product, you can use it in the same manner. And that's why I alluded to the shower routine because in the shower, I use my BHA cleansers <laughs> in those areas, not in the canals, not in the cavities. Keep it on the external level. It's gonna do you real good. I'm telling you something right now. That is my secret. What's my secret to body odor? Uh, controlling, is that how you say it? <laughs> Good to control and body odor. BHA, honey. I also restocked on these 54 Thrones body butters, baby. I have one in my, I have it everywhere. Okay, I have it everywhere. I like my skin to be shiny. We discussed this already. Brown skin looks so good when it's glowing, when it's juicy and dewy. I don't do dry, you know? I don't do dry, you know what I mean? I like my face to look matte, but like, I do enjoy when it's healthily, healthily dewy, healthily. Google it, healthily. So this is the Butter Mini Tree. Very good. It's, I can never have too many of those, you know? I also re-upped on the KVD Beauty Good Apple Balm in the shade 098 because this is the one I use to contour. So beautiful, I actually have it on today. I use it all the time to contour and I actually wanna put this in my suitcase because my contour in my suitcase is, was it Morphe? It's something, it's something, but it's not dark enough. So I bought that to put in my suitcase and you can never have too many lip balms. You know, one thing I don't do again is dry. I don't do dry anywhere in my life. So I needed to re-up on these Laneige Lip Sleeping Masks. I almost wanted to say the shade. The shade is not Gummy Bear. It's the, I want to say flavor. Is it the scent? What do you call this? Whatever it is, I like these. Andrew Renee always talks about, what's another one? It's a new one that has come out. I haven't tried it. I'm just really stuck on Laneige and the other free PR that I get, but I always go back to this one. It's really, really good. Okay, so the one size Patrick Star, turn up the base, versus towel powder foundation dark 4g you already know dark 4g is what i have on today if you see my powder video or any of my videos in life then you know how and when at what stage i use this powder it is very beautiful it's just phenomenal i already have one this is my second one so this is gonna go in my suitcase too because the powder in my suitcase is the fenty 450 and although it does match me i like the goldenness of this i'm putting this separately to remind myself that that's gonna go in my suitcase and then i got the one size 3d blush trio Ooh, it looks beautiful I cannot wait to try this. If you've tried this, I want you to comment and let me know. I loved the idea that it had this orange in here and then the middle one. So you got the cream, the matte powder, and the shimmer. So I'm excited to use this. I know it's been out for some time, but I never had it. I cannot wait to try this. Comment below and let me know if you've tried it, if you love it, what's the deal? Oh my gosh, so Pattern Beauty. I've gotten PR from Pattern Beauty before, Tracy Ellis Ross, Sephora. But then I was like, I want to get this hair. Is this a hairnet? Yeah, satin cap. I'm annoyed. I call it a hair net. It's not for us. I'm not here for those hair nets. I ain't hair nets in a way. Ghana for my way. Comment and let me know because you know exactly what I'm talking about. Everything is BBIA yeah, hair nets. Well, that's what I call this, but it's a satin cap, okay? So let's see what she looked like. Is she going to stay on? Okay. It looks beautiful. It says juicy and joyful. That's cute. Pattern Beauty Tracy Ellis Ross. But is it going to stay on? Because this satin stuff don't be staying. Y'all have this satin cap? Oh, it's pretty tight. Mm, it ain't going to stay when I have my hair pulled back like this, I know that. Oop, not be looking real black. <laughs> Black and beautiful. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I also got three Valentino lipsticks. Now let me tell you. So Jackie had done a coloration. I was like, uh, excuse me, Valentino refillable lipsticks. Definitely reminiscent of the Fenty one. I'm not sure which one came out first, but I saw this and I was like, first of all, it's Valentino. <laughs> so like, you know what I'm saying? I don't even need to use it. I just want to look at it. You know? Gonna definitely put this on in a testing new products video. Look at how beautiful this is. If nothing else, 
It's just the beauty for me. So I got three Valentino lipsticks and the first one I showed you is called, oh, that's annoying. The names are on the box and I took them out of the box and now I don't know the names. I know I got Living Nude, I got Deep Nude and then there's this one, what? That's terrible and annoying. But first of all, it's a sexy engraving the Valentino engraving, just absolutely gorgeous, right? This is terrible that I don't know what shade this is or color this is, but anyway, it's a beautiful nude color. I will be using these. Then I have this one. They all look a little alike right now. <laughs> we ain't doing a swatch today, okay? Praise the Lord. Anyway, I got these three, they're cute. We'll find out how they look on my skin at a later date, okay? I also grabbed the bronze and sculpt trio from one size. And this is the Deep Trio, okay? I've seen Ohima Bonsu use this so many times, so I hope that this one gonna look real good on me. Oh yes, this is deep. This is very deep. It looks way deeper in person. It looks really, really beautiful. So I cannot wait to try this out in a video. I haven't done a contour, what, highlight contour video in a long time. Comment below if you want me to do something like that. It's been a while. I stocked up on these Forever Mood caked up candles. I have two of these, but I already have some in the stash. So mm -hmm. we are adding to the stash right now okay I also got the cuffing season candle because this one's, this one's sweet and just good they're all good okay love this one let me know if you are still loving forever mood candles are you part of the candle club let me know because I am and I'm waiting on the newest launch to come I cannot wait during the April Sephora sale I purchased this Fenty Beauty Sunstalker whatever and it came smashed up so I returned it and forgot to purchase it again so then recently I was like let me go ahead and grab this because I never grabbed it so I'm gonna do a video on this solely and see how we can make it work on the eyes and or the face so we'll see okay so I share with you I mean I've used it for a while right but I've shared with you the say air set radiant loose setting powder and it is the color translucent I understand that there are different translucent translucents just the straight-up translucent is the one that I love I finished the one that I was using in the bathroom and had to get another one this stuff is so good it was sent to me in PR and I absolutely fell in love with it so definitely had to use my own money to restock on that baby and you know how much I love the Lawless One and Done Mascara. I use this all the time on my bottom lashes. I have them on today. I use it every single day. It is phenomenal. The mascara comes out thick. It just, uh, it's just thick and just chunky and thick right away. And that is exactly what I like. My bottom lashes need to be thick and this one gets me there all the time. I have three fragrances, honey. Two of them were a blind buy. <laughs> no, actually one of them was a blind buy. Okay, so I have Kaali Day. Deja Vu White Flower. Now this one, I already have a sample of. We've talked about it and you know that I love it. So this one has notes of Gardenia, Jasmine Absolute, Orange, I love how it comes on the back. Orange Flower, Tuberose Infusion, and Tahitian Vanilla. So stinking good. So I wanted to get the, the large version of it. Ooh, let's spray it and re be reminded, why don't we? Which Kaoli fragrance do you have? If, if so, which one is your favorite? Yes, it's so sexy and warm, like milky kind of sorta. Love, love, love that. And then I just restocked on Juicy Red Apple because yo, Kaylee Juicy Red Apple is a vibe. <laughs> I, already, I already have this, but I got it again because when I had the small version in my suitcase and brought it to Bermuda, we all killed it. Like everyone killed it. The thing is done, dead. Oh, Ankasa. When I was restocking, I said, well, let me just get another one. Another one, thank you. <laughs> because listen, baby, the girls are loving. Okay, Ali, juicing, juicy. Yep, Eden, juicy, apple, her. Okay, this one has juicy red apple, wild berries, jasmine, lychee, vanilla flower, and sensual musk. This one I already know and love. Oh, this one's bigger than my white flower. So we have two different, oh, yeah, 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 this one must be 50 ml, 100. Girl, I can't see it's dark in here because the sun's going down, so I can't see it that well. But here we have Deja Vu White Flower and then we have Eden Juicy Apple. Oh, I love Eden Juicy Apple. Oh, this is great for the summertime, honey. Mmm, apple me, apple me, make me apple. <laughs> oh, yes, oh, yeah. I'm reminded, remember? Remember when I first unboxed this or first tried it? It's definitely giving elevated love spell. So good, I love it. Okay, now this is the last, ooh, it, just, it looks like a carafe. 
It looks like a very expensive carafe, you know, the glass container in which you store or pour from whiskey, you know? Rich men drink that. You might drink whiskey too though, I don't know. Okay, this is Killian Angel Share. It looks like a, a beautiful, expensive glass carafe. Wow, I've never smelled this. This was a blind buy because everyone talks about it. This is 1.7 fluid ounces. I hope I like this. I think I will just going by the notes and everything and how people, how much people like it. So let's see. It's light. I mean, I like it. I don't love it. It doesn't knock me off of my stool, you know? It's not really slapping me in the face like some scents do in a great way. I'm getting cinnamon. I can see how this can be for a man and I can see how this can be for a woman. This is giving me almost jazz club replica. It's giving me a fall scent or maybe an evening summer scent. You can maybe layer this and sweeten it up a little bit. I like it, I don't love it. I'm gonna need to wear it to really make a make an educated decision. <laughs> it's just overly cinnamon. I don't know that I want to be overly cinnamon. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I don't know about this one. Yo, y'all played me. I bought this because y'all be talking about it, and then now here I am. See all these blind buys? I can't do it. Not me being influenced, and I'm confused. Influencing and confusion. Quite literally. Okay, so this is the last thing that I got. I'm gonna have to try it out and, and update y'all because I don't know. I'm very confused by that. The sun's going down, I gotta go, but I'm glad you watched this video. Make sure you watch one of the two videos that I'm gonna leave for you at the end. And as always, again, I'm glad you're here. I post three times a week. Make sure you catch all those videos by subscribing. I'll see you in the next one, bye.